Hey there guys, so today I'm going to show you how to use OBS Studio Transitions. OBS Studio has added a lot of things and some people aren't really aware of some of these features. So I figured I'd just make a video kind of showing that. So to get started, go up to View and click Scene Transitions. It's going to add this area in the bottom right called Scene Transitions, who would have thought? And you'll notice right now it's uncut. so. I switch between my starting soon screen and my not like this screen, then it will just kind of cut. If I click this and change it to fade, it will fade them, just like it says. However, some people don't mess with this enough. You can click the plus, and there's fade to color, there's luma wipe, there's slide, so I'll just add slide as an example. I can have it slide left, and it will slide. So now, if you go and add a luma wipe, there's actually a lot more options. There's circles, there's clouds, there's fan, and I'm going to add sinus 9 because this is probably my favorite. And you can just up the softness, you can lower the softness, you can invert it, all that. So if I add that, and I change it, then it's just a cool effect. And once again, you can click properties and change it to whatever you want. So this one squares. You can also change the duration over here if you want it to be faster or up it if you want it to be slower. And that's basically it. If you ever want to remove the scene transitions, you can just uncheck it again from the view area. And I hope this was helpful. Have a good day.